Let's convert 280 inches into feet and inches. And you can do this one of two ways. If you know that one foot is equal to 12 inches, wanting to know how many feet are in 280 inches is the same as wanting to know how many 12 inches there are then in 280 inches, because that would tell you how many feet. Or you can use unit fractions. We can say 280 inches is equal to 280 inches over 1 times, we want to multiply by the unit fraction so that inches divides out. So I'll place inches in the denominator and so that I have feet, so I'll place feet in the numerator. And then what is the appropriate or what are the appropriate numbers that go here? Well, we know one foot is equal to 12 inches. Now this would convert us totally to feet Instead, we're going to take our remainder, which will be in inches, and place that right here under inches. So what do I have here? I have inches divide out, and I have 280 times 1 divided by 1 times 12. I have 280 divided by 12 feet. So I have 280 divided by 12, and that is in feet. So let's go off to the side and let's divide 12 into 280. We want to see how many 12's there are in 280. That tells us how many feet there are in 280 inches. Well, how many 12's are in 28? That would be 2. 2 times 12 is 24. And when we subtract, we have a remainder of 4. Bring down the 0. How many 12's are there in 40? That would be 3. 3 times 12 is 30. 6, remainder of 4. Now this is how many whole 12's there are. So this is how many whole feet there are in 280 inches. And then our remainder is still in inches. So I'll place that right there. 280 inches then is 23 feet 4 inches.